TikTok is one of, if not the easiest and best social media platforms to grow on right now. So if you want to be a full-time content creator and don't know where to start or you don't know how to grow, you absolutely need to be on TikTok. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to increase your TikTok following with Fortnite content and other gaming content as well. So let's get into it. To start off, I want to show you guys my analytics on TikTok and how easy it can be. So as you see here in the last 7 days, I've gained almost 7.4 million views, um, nearly 26,000 followers, and really close to 71,000 profile views. In addition to that, I have gained 880,000 likes roughly over that same 28 day span. Now that you know my numbers, I'm going to show you 5 tips on how to grow on TikTok. Number 1. Hashtags. Don't overdo with hashtags. I've done a lot of experimenting with hashtags, trying out different combinations, and I found too many hashtags can actually hurt your views and your chances of getting on the FYP page. After a lot of testing, I found out using hashtag Fortnite, hashtag For You, hashtag For You page, and hashtag FYP, as well as one or two training hashtags is the best combination to getting on the For You page and increasing your views. Number two, sound. Unless your TikTok goes perfectly with the sound you had in mind, use a sound from the trending section. Even if the sound doesn't necessarily fit your content, you can turn the TikTok sound down all the way down to zero. I do this all the time with my TikToks. So use trending sounds. You'll get on the FYP more often. Number three, consistency and frequency. If you're first starting out, the more content you can put out, the better. When I first started seeing growth on TikTok is when I started posting four times a day at 2, 4, 6, and 8 p.m. every single day for about three weeks. I'd say when you first start off, quantity is more important than quality because you never know what's going to go viral. Here's my first viral video that I got 1.4 million views and I gained around 2,000 followers. I had no idea it would perform well, but I needed to post something, so I just went ahead and posted it and it blew up. All it is is I kill this guy and Sky's scar falls off the ledge and I yell no. Um, I don't have the sound on because there's no volume mixer on um, the webpage for TikTok and it's, it's extremely loud. But yeah, no idea. I just posted this just to post something and this was my first viral video. So you never know what's really going to go viral on TikTok. So overall, post as much as possible in the beginning while you figure out your format and content type, which we'll, we'll talk about here in a minute. Number four, content. When you make content, you want to provide value and give your audience a reason to watch you. Take a second and think why you watch your streamers, YouTubers, TikTokers, etc. Maybe you watch Muse Elk and Laser Beam because they're entertaining and funny. Maybe you watch Cypher BK because he gives great tips and tricks. Or maybe you watch Boogle or Clicks because you like watching top tier gameplay. Whatever the content is, there's a reason why you watch it. Now kind of reverse it. You're the content creator and put yourself in your viewers shoes. Why would they want to watch you? Do they want to watch you because you're entertaining and funny? Do they want to watch you because you're giving out information like Fortnite news, Fortnite leaks, or maybe tips and tricks? For example, for me, I put a lot of tips and tricks on my TikTok, and then on my YouTube, I typically like to post challenge videos that are entertaining. So now think of how you want to provide value to your audience. Number five, format. When it comes to TikTok, I think format and standing out is important. If you notice, 75% of my TikToks um, have my little circle webcam here in the middle as well as this uh, orange block text at the top. Now I'm not saying you have to do anything like like I do, but do something that makes you stand out and that your audience recognizes your content immediately. So when they're scrolling through the For You, for you page, um, they come across your content and they immediately recognize that that's your content because it's, it's a similar format to the rest of your content. So those are my top five tips on how to grow on TikTok with gaming content. I still have a lot of growth myself and plan on experimenting and improving my content as well. So if I discover any more growth strategies, I'll definitely let you guys know. If you found any of this information helpful, I'd absolutely for you to like and subscribe. I typically post challenge videos here on YouTube every Monday and Friday with giveaways every Friday. So good luck with your growth on TikTok. And if you have any questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Peace out.